I just want to say one of my favorite writers growing up was a man named James Baldwin. And I remember Baldwin saying, you asked my father to wait, my brother to wait, my uncle to wait. How long must I wait on freedom? How long must I wait on rights and equality and liberty? And as a black child, that resonated with me because I knew I had been denied and I personalized that. But as I grew, I started to understand poor white people have been denied, women have been denied, gays and lesbians, transgender people been denied. Everybody outside of that 1% has been denied. So I want you to take a few seconds to look to your left and look to your right. Look to your neighbor and say, neighbor, the time is now. There are more of us. We're stronger. We will wait no longer. Our time is right now. Make sure that wherever you go, you take the name, the ideas, the philosophy, and the ideology of Bernie Sanders there. And you make sure when you leave, they are on fire because they have felt the burn. And the whole point of the political revolution is that nobody, not Bernie or anybody else, can do it alone. We have got to do it together by the millions. It ain't Bernie, it is you, it must be you. The time is now. The time is not in the future. The time is not some abstract time. The time is not something that might be. The time ain't something that could be. The time ain't nothing that should be, that would be. It ain't tomorrow, it ain't the day after, it ain't coming next week. The time is, the time is, the time is, the time is. If they're telling you to wait and hold on, don't wait and hold on. We want progress and we want it now.